This is the homework for lesson three of module six of second grade. Write your name on here first. And writing a repeated addition equation to match the picture. Repeated addition is adding the same number over and over again, the same add end. And then uh, it says group the add ends into pairs to show a more efficient way to add. So instead of just counting everything in the picture, we can use if you're especially if you're good at doubles this one works like crazy so here we have uh, squirrels groups of squirrels and there's four in each group right one two three four so these are fours and there's four groups of them so we have four fours and if you're good with doubles four plus four is eight and this four and that four make eight it's kind of like an upside down number bond and now we're looking at eight plus eight and if you know that double you know that's 16. So that means 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 is 16. So 4 groups of 4 is the same as, right, because this is the idea here, that these 4 groups of 4 are the same as these 2 groups of 8. There. Because they both equal 16. And now we've got some birds. So there's 2 of two birds in each group so that's two 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 right four groups and now looking at this these two plus two is four and this two plus two is four so we have four plus four and that's eight and two four six eight four twos is eight so four groups of two equals and this is the four groups of two equals these two groups of four. And now we've got dogs and it looks like we have one, two, three, four, five in each group and there's four of them. So we need four fives, five plus five plus five plus five. And we're combining these so that these two fives here, you don't have to draw this, those lines, but those two fives make this 10. And these two fives make this 10. 10 plus 10 is 20. And you can also count by fives. 5, 5, 10, 15, 20. Four groups of five, that's all of these up here, is the same as two groups of 10. Write a repeated addition equation to match the picture and then group the add ends into pairs to add and add to find the total. Very much like the same thing we've been doing, uh, except there's going to be a little left over here. So we have groups of three, and there's one, two, three, four, five groups of three. So we have one, two, three, four, five threes. Now these two will go together to make a six and these two will make another six but then this three right here he doesn't have a partner so he's just got to stay a three so we have six plus six and we still have the plus three and now since we have six plus six we can combine the two sixes to make a 12 and we still have the plus three because he's still but now we finally have to add him because we're down to two add ends 12 plus three more 15. So it means this whole thing, five when it was just five threes right there, it was 15 then. And when it was two sixes and a three, it was 15 then. And when it's 12 plus three, it's still 15 because it's the same five groups of three cats, no matter how you look at it. All right, these look like worms. And they're in groups of two, right? Two, four six eight ten we can count them but there's we had we need five groups of two so two 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 and think about the pairs right that's there's a pair and there's a pair right so the first two twos they make that four there and the next two twos they make that four right there and then this two here well, he doesn't have a partner, so he's just going to stay a two. So now we have two fours and a two, but well, we can combine these two fours. So these two fours together make 
this eight and this two still doesn't have a partner now so he's still just plus two so eight plus two is ten partners to ten we should know that and then since these are all equal they're all ten